I just really wanted to think of a way to thank Monica. I have no idea where we're going. I am taking you to Chester Zoo today. No, we're not going to the zoo. But yeah, we are. I've just booked tickets. What's up, guys? How are you doing today? So, it's been a few days since we went to the zoo now. Quite honestly, there's been no point vlogging the days since the zoo because Monica and I have literally just been working non-stop. So if you guys didn't know, we run a social media management company called Infinite Management. After a massive long slog, we thought, how about let's just kind of take a day off and relax, or well, not take a day off, we've got to do some work, but you know, let's just mostly relax today and have a movie day, watch some movies. I think we're going to hang out with my buddy Sean. I don't know, just see what we get up to and we thought we'll bring you guys along for the journey because you guys get to see what it's actually like on a kind of day to, oh my gosh, there's this fly buzzing around non-stop and it's the most annoying bugger ever. So I thought I'd bring you guys along on the journey to kind of see what we do on a regular day when we haven't really planned anything. You know, a kind of a regular day of what it's like to actually be in a long distance relationship when you're actually together. Let's get started. But first, I'm making waffles. I can't, I can't say anything like, do like donkey can. I'm making waffles. <laughs> yeah, Monica is currently in bed, by the way, guys. Now I'm gonna make us some breakfast, like I said, some waffles. What was that? I just sounded weird then. And then uh, I'll bring them to Monica in bed. The smell of sweet waffles will probably wake her up. <laughs> Hopefully. Yes! I tried to do a little love heart, but I knew she'd want more whipped cream than that, so it kind of failed. Did you see a little lump on the bed? Hi, cutie girl. So we got waffles. <laughs> I put a love heart on yours, but it kind of failed. Hmm. Thank you. You're welcome, baby. How are you doing today? Tired. I told you I'd wake her up, guys. How about, darling? We eat our waffles, have a cuddle, because I know you're not going to actually wake up fully for another hour. Mm hmm And watch the rest of the movie we were watching yesterday. Mm. Yes! Does that sound good? Okay, my kitty girl. Don't come in. No! Hi, kitty baby. Hi. Hi, cutie baby. <laughs> hey, just pop out the covers a little bit. No way, sucker. <laughs> We're almost finished with the movie. We just wanted to call the doctors because Mom wanted to visit the doctors. Monica's had these spots on her chin for like a few months now, haven't you? And you used to have absolutely perfect skin and she's got these spots on her chin they that just go won't go away. away. Yeah, so we called the doctor surgery to uh, to speak to someone about it and see if she could get a, an appointment with a dermatologist or something like that. And um, the lady she was speaking to was called Susan and Monica had to call her back. And this, Monica is the most nervous person on a phone ever. She's... <laughs> That's funny. So she called up this doctor surgery, and this lady called Heidi answered rather than Susan, and she freaks out, looks at me like, "What do I say?" I was like, "Well, ask for Susan." <laughs> I she was like, "Say that." Hi, um, is Susan there? Get out of you, sucker! I'll go back. And, and then, up. and I started laughing. She was like, "What? I don't know how a doctor sister works in the UK." I was like, "I was like, you literally have to ask for her <laughs> name, darling. That's how. That's how a phone call works." Goodbye. I'm going in my hut, and I'm never coming out. <laughs> <laughs> Hi cutie baby. Are you mad at me? Yeah. Listen, you're never allowed in my hut again. Wait, you're a temporary patient. I told you guys she has to ask me for everything. Please don't pick up. Please don't pick up. Please don't pick up. You say please don't pick up. How can I help you? Hi, is this Susan? So it's about an hour later or so. We finished watching the movie. Monica has had a shower. As you can see, my little wrapped up cutie baby. I am currently, well, I'm just about to play my first video game in about, what would you say? When was the last time I played a video game? Five months. Yeah, five or six months. We don't really show it in videos much, but we are so busy with work and stuff like that that yeah, like Mon just said, I haven't played a video game in like five or six months and I'm, I'm, well, I used to be absolutely obsessed with them. Monica and I were thinking, because one of the massive positives of our job is that it's all online. So obviously, you know, YouTube is all online, we can film anywhere we want and Infinite Management, our social media management company is online. We can work from wherever we want as long as we've got an internet connection. So we we're thinking, how about spontaneously next week or in a couple of weeks or something, Let's go somewhere in Europe. I really want to go somewhere. Yeah? Where do we go? Where do you guys think we should go? Comment below. 
Comment below and we're like, thinking Italy or France or anywhere. Italy would be cool. Yeah. Italy. Have you ever been to Italy? Milan. Oh yeah, we went to Milan, didn't we? We can go to South France because that's 20 miles away from the Italian border and they've got the best of both worlds because I'm obsessed with Monaco. I was about to say, you want to just go to Nice so we can go to Monaco. Yeah, I just want to go to Monaco. <laughs> Comment where we should go, okay, and we'll book it based on your comments. So should we go to Italy? Should we go to South France? So like Nice, Monaco kind of area. Maybe Barcelona? Portugal? Portugal would be cool. We could go Portugal. Norway? I kind of, I was looking at Paris earlier. We've already been to Paris together. I love Paris. But I think we're going to go to Paris in December, mm. aren't we? Because one of Monica's friends lives in Paris, Sophia. But yeah, comment below, guys, where you think we should go. It's Darling? And I can't stop myself from smiling. Butterfly. What do you have to show me? Don't freak out. Okay. <gasps> what are those? <laughs> <laughs> they are cool socks, honey. Let's name him Bernard. Huh? Let's name him Bernard. 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 You say it's so British. Let's go to Nando's, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Mr. Silent Jones has just walked in. Hi, birdie. Really? We're in, we're in Nando's. We just ordered our food. Sean's gone to the loo, and Monica is playing her Harry Potter game. Look, I can <laughs> use that now. Yes, honey, 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 honey. Ready? Yes. So it's like a cute little Mickey outfit for a baby, right? Okay. Oh, dear. oh, there's a little hat as well. Do you know anybody who owns a baby? So we finished lunch now, guys, and we're just doing a little bit of shopping. <sighs> Unfortunately, to get up to the men's section, because Sean's just doing some shopping in the men's section, we had to pass the baby section. And that excited Monica and gave her a little bit of baby fever, didn't it, darling? I don't want a baby, just for everybody asking that for a very long She's time. got but baby I fever, love, guys. I just love looking at baby stuff. I just love looking at other people's babies. <laughs> just bought a game. We went into a game shop, bought a game, and now we're getting this really insanely good dessert. <laughs> Mon we're talking about the spots on Monica's chin and how to get rid of them. She goes, yeah, I think it's because I eat dairy and sugar. Sugar. I was like, really? This looks amazing, doesn't it, darling? Like you. <laughs> like you. What? Are you, what's on your phone? My nails. You aren't, you're not playing Harry Potter again, are you? And we are home! So guys, if you haven't seen my vlogs before or you haven't seen my horsies before, this is little Peggy Poo. Well, Peggy. And this is D'Artagnan, who's also called Panusha Musketeer. That's his show name. There is Polly in there as well. Hey, buddy. <laughs> He's already <Wow>. smiling. <laughs> That's my boy. Right, we are now back home, and as you can tell from the lighting and Monica in the background, we're just about to film a video for her channel. This really is just kind of a day in the life. Like this is what this is the kind of stuff we do every day, isn't it, darling? And I just thought that rather than kind of like you know sprucing everything up for the camera and leading a fake life just you know to make it more entertaining content, I thought, how about we show you guys what an actual day in the life is, and this is actually what a day in our life is like. There's three things that we want to bring up. Number one, we hit 10,000 subscribers in a month. How insane is that? I couldn't even believe it when you told me that. That is ridiculous. Okay, okay, we're going to insert the clip of when I told Monica, when I announced to Monica that we hit 10,000 subscribers. Hey, darling, guess what? What? We've officially hit 10,000 no, subscribers in a right month. Now. No, we did not in right now. In a month. No, we didn't. What the heck? In a month. Seriously, guys, thank you so much. It really, honestly, does mean so much to us, doesn't it, I darling? I didn't even think we would get, like, 500 within the first two months. No, sir yeah, seriously, <laughs> like, though. Actually. When we first started this, this relationship channel, we thought, okay, it's going to be a long road, but it's going to be super fun to film these videos and all that kind of stuff. But we literally, I, I honestly wasn't expecting anything like this. I was expecting to get, like Monica said, 500 subscribers within the next few months or so. And to hit 500 in a day and 10,000 in a month is... It's just insane. Firstly, yeah, thank you so, so much for that, guys. It honestly means so much to us. Secondly, we need you guys to comment down below because we want to book a spontaneous vacation or a holiday, as us Brits say. Basically because, I don't know, I just, I can't stay in one place I for too long. I get travel fever. I get travel fever. We get travel fever very easily. And thirdly, we want to kind of involve you guys in the content a lot more on this channel. 
the Sonic line is really building up now and I feel like we're not just talking to a camera anymore, we're actually talking to people watching the videos, which is incredible. To involve you guys in the channel a lot more, we want help with the content. Like, what do you guys actually want to see? What do you want us to do? Anything crazy? Anywhere where you think we should go? Any, like, place that... Any person you think we should meet and try and collab with or anything? Anything you want any us to ideas? do? Like, uh, any ideas, just, just drop them in the comments below. And if you like someone's idea, then give it a like. We want this channel to be kind of directed by you guys, okay? So, we're the cast, you're the directors. So, choose what you want and we'll do it. I want it to be something we do anyway, because yeah. at the end of the day, this channel is all about just kind of following us in our journey of our relationship. So, we want you guys to kind of follow us in real time of when we're traveling back and forth to America and any problems we have and eventually as things progress in the relationship, different steps we take, you know, moving in together, maybe getting a pet together, getting engaged eventually, okay. all that kind of stuff. Monica desperately wants a fish. She's I really talking just about want a mom. fish right now. <laughs> if we get thing. enough people commenting below, I will <laughs> think about it. Guys, comment below that we should get a fish, please, please. If enough of you comment below saying we should get a fish together, then uh, I will cry. Please. I'll consider it. Okay. Please. I don't but yeah. Anyway. <laughs> anyway, it was just turned into you begging for a fish. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Alright, anyways, don't film this, Sam. Oh, I'm filming it. I can't duel right now. Why can't you duel right now? I do I have to use gems, and I don't want to use my gems because I'm saving up to buy a cat. <gasps> I think I have enough money for a cat right now, I'm not even kidding. <laughs> should I buy a cat? You're buying a cat. Should I? On your Harry Potter game. Or should I save up for an owl? I say you buy cats, because you love kitties. I feel like this Harry Potter game is like a sponsorship, because we've talked about it so much today. <laughs> Literally not. Guys, this isn't a sponsorship. Monica is just obsessed with this Harry Potter game. Do I spend money on it, or do I save my gems? I say you get a kitty. I bought it. Oh my gosh, you've got a cat. Is it going to follow you around everywhere now? I don't know. I bought it. <laughs> We're going to get to bed now. Monica's just been chatting to her sister, and you are now in the middle of playing your Harry Potter game, aren't you, darling? I just bought a cat, and I kind of wish I didn't, though. Really? Yeah, because okay. I feel bad because I'm always in danger in the game. I don't want to danger my cat. I think your cat will be okay. Darling. I think we should get a fish. Anyway, conclusion for this video, guys. We eat a lot. Um, I want a fish. Monica wants a fish. What kind of content do you want us to do, and where should we go on vacation? So let us know, and in the next video, we'll be figuring it out.